look at some of the basic urinary structures on our cat specimen. Uh, this right here is going to be our left kidney. And this one is the right kidney. And on the surface of each kidney is going to be this tissue layer. It, it kind of looks like a wet paper towel. That's how I like to describe it. And, and it moves around a little bit. Um, that is actually going to be the renal capsule. So that covers each kidney. On the medial portion of the kidney is this indentation. And we, that indentation is called the renal hilus or hilum. I'll show that to you on this side as well. The hilum or hilus describes kind of an, an entry into whatever organ you're talking about. And it'll be for things like blood vessels or nerves. For the kidneys, we're also going to be referring to these ureters. So um, the hilum, again, or hilus is that indented portion. It doesn't matter which form of the word you use, by the way. That is not a singular or plural form. It's just two alternative spellings of, of the same thing. So this would be the left renal vein. This is going to be the left ureter. We'll come back to the ureters in a little bit. And the renal artery is going to be better visualized on the posterior side. If you see me retracting it like this, that right there is going to be the left renal artery. I'll show this to you quickly on the right side. So right renal vein, right ureter, and then again, when we flip this over, we get a much better visualization of that right renal artery. Okay, the other major structure I wanna point out before we return to those ureters is this urinary bladder. This urinary bladder is going to be the pouch that holds the urine before it's excreted through the urethra. And the tube, this small tube right here, comes from the kidney. So I, I always suggest this. It's easy when you're on a quiz, you know, you see a pin right here and you can kind of just hyper-focus right there. I always recommend widen your view so you can see the context of that pin. Remember that the, ure uh, the ureters, excuse me, connect the kidney to that urinary bladder. So this tube that comes out of that renal hilus, okay, we can see it right here, and it connects to the bladder. That means this is the right ureter. Let's go to the left side. Okay, this tube, you can see it's coming out of that left kidney, we follow that along, connects to the urinary bladder, so you know without a shadow of a doubt that is the left ureter. This becomes much more important in the reproductive system, um, and you guys don't know this term yet, maybe. Um, if you're my students, you don't know this term yet, but these tubes right here are actually part of a cat's uterus, and again, we will come back to this in, in the reproductive chapter but students mix these up all the time, and I can get that, um, except for the fact that we have to make sure that we remember what body system we're, we're in, and then to what that passageway connects. So always make sure that you're looking around when you're given a passageway, see what it connects. And then finally, the urethra, that is going to be the passageway from the bladder to the um, external genitalia. Want to stay up to date on my latest videos? Please hit like and subscribe. And don't forget to check my Instagram page at The Anatomy Gal. See you next time.